Mr. Rick, hey, it's Chris. I thought I could put together a quick video better than I could try to edit some pictures. Um, first of all, I went to the county, got a copy of our plat, and I'll send an attachment so you'll have a better picture. But I'm here, lot number 28. I've got the dimensions. We're 24, I'm sorry, 36 feet and 124.18 to the back. So if you come out here to the curb, uh, the surveyor was able to locate the neighbor's pin uh, right here. Okay, and we were not able to locate mine in the front because it falls right underneath where, where the mailbox is. But we measured and we stood it off, and it is dead center in the back from the one in the back that I'll show you. And go back here real quick. The camera will probably be shaky. It just Look till I get back here and steady it. Um, okay, these two indicate my property line. This is the corner on the next one over where there's a bend where that angle starts. Okay, from there we go 36, and we actually located the pin here. We go 36 feet over. This is uh, my property line where we, we didn't find a pin. This is uh, this is somewhat approximate, um, but it is correct by the measurement. So that should mark, mark the corner. And then the uh, next one marks the lot behind us, which is three feet over. So we were able to measure that. It does line up directly with. Uh, the firewall and the fence line and so that's uh, accurate property line markers and what we're proposing is just bringing the fence back to the property line of course we're going to cheat probably uh, six inches to a foot on the on the inside of the line just to be safe um, this is the clearing of done on getting this hill cleaned out I'm also considering the possibility of bringing the fence over because uh, you see I've got a good probably four to five feet and I could probably bring this out another three to four feet staying well within inside the property line and also leaving enough way for a, a walkway in here and that that I did the math and that would add a, an additional 150 square feet or so so that's the proposal that's the again the two corners uh, that mark the property line we want to stay approximately six six inches to a foot inside of it and and just bring it all the way back um, we'll do it with the same lumber it's four by four post one uh, one by six slats and two by four studs and that is uh, that's pretty much it if this doesn't work let me know and I'll I'll get it proposed to you some other way thank you